Hello my Yankee friends! It's Thursday! I've been waiting all week for this day. I have not crafted since I saw... Todd gets to watch a commercial. He forgot. You have to mute the whole computer, honey. <laughs> He's like, where's the mute button? Oh my god, I've never used a computer before. Is this Windows? Or is this Mac? Or is this, is this Apple? He uses Windows. What was I going to say? I haven't crafted since last Thursday, since I saw you guys. I have been doing nothing but computer work, administration, getting my website revamped. I hired a web designer. I'm so excited. So everything's a little bit messy over there right now. But would you like to say hi? Hello. <laughs> I was like, everybody's, I think everybody's outside enjoying the beautiful outdoors because it was awfully quiet when Todd and I got in here, there were no peoples. There were no inky friends, inky buddies, inky besties. There was nobody. I was like, everybody is outside playing in this beautiful weather. We're supposed to get some rain. I got to tell you guys, you know those egg chairs that kind of hang and, you know, the egg chairs, they look like, like half an egg. <laughs> We got two. I just love it. I could sleep in it. Me and Bella, we could just sleep in it. But I, if you are just tuning in to the replay, you can skip forward nine minutes to skip all the jibber jabber. Okay, now that all the people that aren't cool are gone, <laughs> that don't want to listen to our jibber jabber, they've all gone nine minutes ahead. So how is everybody? Mary, Mary's stencils are on the way to her. Katie and Sarah with the curly hair. Mary DeConning, who told me she was coming over. Wasn't it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was Mary. There's so many Marys. I get them all mixed up. I get them. I'm hoping. Blah, blah, blah. Let's just backspace the rewind, delete. Blah, 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 delete, delete, delete. Kelly and Katie and Nancy, Mary, Melissa, Ruby, Robin, Cheryl Lee, Cindy Curry. Where the heck is Cindy Lynn? Cindy Lynn B. And her husband Todd. <laughs> Charlene and Kimberly. I haven't seen Kimberly or Charlene in a while. And Patty, Miss Patty, Patty, our OG. You are very welcome. My um, mom told me she took care of all that for you. Hello, Julie from Louisiana. We are going to do a draw tonight. So we are going to draw for the Pink and Main giveaway that had, how many entries did it have? I think it had 272 entries. So someone will be getting a $25 gift card tonight for Pink and Main. And someone will be getting an Inky Bestie membership. I am, as of next week, it's looking like next week, you'll be able to actually register as a monthly member or tri monthly or semi annually or annually. <laughs> Words are hard. I don't know. But you'll be able to register. So I'm so super excited about that. And all your links will all be right there. All beautifully laid out. And you never have to worry about where to go. and Where are they? And yada, yada, yada. So that's going to be awesome. Um, oh, I got to show you guys something. Um, honey, can you grab me the thing on that door over there? The thing. Just the thing that's hanging on the door there. I have a new class over at Crit Hunt. That door over there. That's that's um, adhered to the door. That's the dry wet board. It won't come off. But that. And then I'm going to pass it back to you. But I made a new video for all my Creative Fabrica loving members. So are you guys ready? Look at this. Oh, isn't that so pretty? Ooh, I love it. So I just made a wreath. And I'm just in the process of finishing that video off. Um, the butterfly goes at about 11 o'clock when you hang it up, honey. So if you're a member over there, you'll get to see that video. I'm super excited about that. And um, I've got another one coming up. What am I doing? How to make, oh yeah, unique fridge magnets with your Cricut. Right? Okay, so I have a diehard giveaway tonight. And all those people that skip forward nine minutes aren't going to know what to do. If you are on Card Kit Crafters, you A, have to be a member of Card Kit Crafters. B, you must be a subscriber. And obviously you're a subscriber. You can't chat. 
And if you're watching the replay, make sure you subscribe. And um, subscribe to my blog. So just those three things. And you've got to leave me a comment. And don't start commenting now, okay, you guys? Don't comment right now in the comments. Like, comment after the video. So after the live is over, in the comments, um, I want to know what the die is in this thing that I'm giving away, okay? So it was in the Card Kit Crafters video for the unboxing for the Stamps of Life this well, last month, and it was in there. And there's a die in here with a matching stamp set. Whatever the die is, um, you should probably leave me a sentence yeah leave me a sentence with whatever the name of that die is well not the name what type of die it is so after the video okay so a sentence with whatever that die is because you've seen the video and i'm going to draw that next week so thursday make a note to myself draw the i'm not going to say it out loud what it is but i'm going to write it the mm, mm, mm. Uh, set there we go so I will draw that set from the comments live next week so yay it's 556 here in Calgary holy cow we only have 10 more minutes so um, for May we have two kits I know for sure coming one possible I've got the stamps of life it's their third and last month I don't know if we'll be working together anymore after this month but the stamps of life and pink and main pink and main i'd like to see a thumbs up for everybody who's excited about this but michelle and i have agreed to work together indefinitely with pink and main so that is awesome for you guys you guys are going to have a 25 dollar gift card so that's super exciting i'm happy 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 about that and michelle is also going to start sending me the stamp and die of the month which I got last month's. I got it a little late because I added it to Heather's order. I mean, it accidentally fell in Heather's cart. I don't even know how that happened. But, oh wait, no, this wasn't the stamp and die. Wait, I thought I got the stamp and die, the ladybugs. No, this one was um, in clearance. This one here is the little sea animals one. And it was only $10 with the dies. So look at them. They're just so cute, and I'm not even like a lakey sea person, but I just saw this little guy here, and I could just picture him with like a witch's hat for Halloween, or bunny ears for Easter. You know me, I don't like, you know me, I don't like to do things the way they're supposed to be done. And, being that I don't like to do things the way they're supposed to be done, wait till you guys see what I got in store for you tonight, I'm so excited. Hello, 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 Nancy, Joe, Heather, and I think I said hi to Julie, but okay, what else have I got? Okay, I've got some, I've got some happy mail that I'm very happy to share. Happy mail? Oh, the oh, hold on, hold on. We gotta draw, we gotta draw the the the, the pink and mean before all the people who skip forward nine minutes come back. So hold on. Uh, we go here, and then we go over here, and then we go over here. Yes. Ha 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 ha. So. The first number drawn is generate number 218 for the $25 gift card. The second number drawn is number 34 for the Inky Bestie membership. I'm gonna go look at what those numbers are. I can't connect to my other computer right now, so all the things I put on the screen to hide all the addresses are not on this computer, so I'm sorry. You just have to trust me. So, number 218 is, dun, dun, oh, geez Louise, would help if I could see. Okay, number 218 is, dun, 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 are you ready? Let's make sure, yes, they put the right keyword. So, number 218 is Jessica, they, uh, I'm going to type it in the chat. I'm going to type it in the chat because I don't know how to say this name. Typing it in the chat right here. Jessica, I will spell it V-E-L-A-Z-Q-U-E-Z. -E -E and the second number was, so let me put Jessica V-A-L. I'm just going to highlight her red. That's what I'll do. 
I'll just highlight her red. Jessica has 10 days to claim her prize. If she does not claim her prize within 10 days, it will be redrawn. And we redrew three times last month. So number 34 for the Inky Bestie membership giveaway is Karen Shipman. So I shall highlight Karen Shipman as well. There we go. All right, perfect. That was me trying to look at the computer. So I have got, I have got some happy mail. And I know, I know two of you are like, ooh, ooh. Okay, so first things first. I got a package from Etsy, which was rather confusing. And I'm gonna tell you why it was confusing. It was confusing because I have a plethora of orders <laughs> that come to me. Plethora? All the time. It's not supposed to. I mean, I, ha I have, it's pl plentiful. I have pl 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 peanuts. I have pe peanuts, it was the wrong Amazon, keyword. Amazon came six times today. No, that wasn't Amazon. The first time was well, the, the Stamps of Life kit, times. and that was that was a specific shipper. And the second time was, what was the second? Oh, the second one was Tombow. Oh, I got a shout out to Tombow. Even though they can't get it together and get me on their affiliate list, or email me back, or call me back, their product is awesome, and their shipping is awesome. I ordered on Friday, um, $30 free shipping and it got here today. That was the second order. The third order was Amazon and it was Bella's doggy sunglasses. Anyway, so I got this order from Etsy and I looked at it and I'm like, I don't remember ordering these things. <laughs> I didn't remember ordering these things. And I'm like, what? What? And I'm like, this is a really cool thing. It's like a little spoon. It's a nouveau spoon. I could see why I would order something like that. And this has this little pug. I could see why I would order something like that, but I just, I was, I was dumbfounded. I was showing Todd, we were in the truck, cause I can never wait. I have to open my things in the truck. And I was just like, I don't even know. No, I show my mom, <laughs> whoever. I'm like, I don't even know. Was I with you, honey? When I was trying to open this? I can't remember. Any, how come I see red? How come I see you on your screen? Are you watching there. the chat? Yeah, it says, hello, Mr. Icky Fingers. Okay, all right. So I got playing and I'm like looking at it and I'm reading it and I'm like, Etsy. I'm like, Inspiration Station. Did they just like, and this is, this is what it looks like, by the way. And I'm looking at it and I'm reading over here and I'm like, Inspiration Station. Did they just like randomly mail this to me and I'm going to like give them a shout out? Like, where's the notes? And I'm like, love your gift. I'm like, gift. And then I look over here and it says, from an inky bestie so not only did an inky bestie send me these things thank you thank you thank you thank you so much they didn't even tell me their name like random act of kindness it's like you know what this person can fix someone's tiara and doesn't need to tell a soul about it you know you know those kind of people but i would really like to know who you are <laughs> you know that would be nice thank you thank you very much so the stamps got this cute little pug Pug Bud here and this cute little dash hound and it says dash hounds through the snow he sugar pug fairy little paw print little little this here is cute little fairy wand I was like what what but this I'm gonna tell you what this is going immediately right there well maybe over here yeah because it's a spoon because now when I mix up my little concoctions with my little yellow spoon and everybody's like oh where do you find that yellow spoon now I'm going to use this and I'm going to be like, mm -hmm. see, my Inky Bestie got my back because they're like, Cindy Lynn, you can link to this now. They were doing me a flavor. It was awesome. Thank you, Inky Bestie. Then I got this beautiful card right here. Are you seeing this? Such a pretty card. Okay. From Jane, Jane R. And it said, not Wilbur, maybe Charlotte. This was on the packaging, okay? Like this is their address and stuff. This was on the packaging, the whole box. And it said, not Wilbur, maybe Charlotte. So I was like, ooh, this person knows me, what's up? So I got this card. So I'm just going to town. I'm trying to rip apart this box. And then I get this box like this, okay? And it's all taped up. So I'm getting my car keys in there and I'm trying to like open it all up. And I opened it and I was like, oh! This was what I saw first. I was like, oh, oh my God, look at these. Stop. Hold on a second. One, two, 
Oh, you can't hide the words are hard. Let's put you in the middle. And they've got like bean baggy stuff in their bums here. So they just kind of sit perfectly. I'll, I'll like dress them up. They will, they wait till you guys see the studio tour. What's all up on those things. But then I was like, look at the size of these googly eyes. I can put these on think like, mm, I might even be able to put them on the switch. All kinds of different things to make it look like it's like, you know, all your machines that have like the Gemini. I'll probably stick them over there and make it look like a mouth. Oh my God. I was just like, yeah, I love them. And two packs of these here water brushes. Funny enough, I needed two more regular ones in order to do a video for something. So I was, oh, let me put these back in the box. I was very, 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 very surprised. I think this person not Wilbur, maybe Charlotte, Miss, or yeah, Miss Jean. I think they knew that I really wanted those dollar store gnomes and couldn't get them and mailed me those. So that was like, wow, I was not expecting that. Thank you very, 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 very much to both my inky bestie and Jane R. I appreciate that. Feel very, very special. Oh, Jen, possibly, look at her go. Little Miss Jen. You know, Jen, she's a sweet gal, she is. Well, she's here, what am I gonna say, right? So, <laughs> I have got something special for you guys tonight. I have been showing you and hinting all about this new, I'm not releasing it today, I'm so sorry, but I am gonna give away one today of these. And I'm going to tell you why I do these giveaways. I'm going to be perfectly honest with you. Um, you can see here, like the, the swirls and curls and over here it says make a splash over here. It says Mandela. Oh, sorry. Oh, it says Mandel dots, dear. What? It says Mandel dots. Where? It's supposed to say Mandela dots. Do you type much? Oh, good you, grief. You, did you spell check? Much? I made 11 sets of these today. It's on your computer. Did you Where double check? I need a husband beater. Can somebody send me one of those things? I could just go, you know, anyway. Did you make and then sure this one, um, oh wait, maybe this is the old one. Yeah, maybe it did get fixed on the new one because this is my first one. And then the on this one, we put the name in the middle. Anyway, so this morning, first set I did, it, it the laser engraver wasn't warmed up. So this is like printed in half and this one was half printed. So I just package them as a giveaway. So. I am going to do a giveaway today for a package of them and your name will go here. Someone in this live stream. This one is make a splash and I'm going to use this today. I am going to do a father's day card, but I'm going to tell you two things. First things first, everybody really struggles with masculine cards. I'm going to make it so stupid, simple for you. And I'm just going to make it super stupid, simple, but one of the things I thought about when it came to Father's Day cards is we have a lot of ladies, need a drink? We have a lot of ladies and gentlemen that follow my channel and watch my videos and let me see some thumbs up in the, in the, in the comments if you're one of them that don't, no longer can mail their father a Father's Day card. But they have a husband. So I want to see thumbs up in the chat for everybody that has a husband or, or, you know, either you can't mail a card to your father because they're no longer here or you just have a husband and you agree with me. So today is I have got a funny, humorous card that anyone can make for their husband for Father's Day. Well, I'm not going to say anyone. You, you'll, I, I did, I did cheat and I used a cricket, but you can totally substitute and follow along. I know you guys are creative, creative enough, but. I have got my, this is all I'm going to use right here, 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 and my little thingies. That's it. Simple, simple supplies today. Okay. Oh, and this, it rolled away, but I am going to, I feel like I have food in my teeth. <laughs> we just had dinner. Mm. Okay. The Weight Watchers thing. I, I told everybody I would tell you guys, I'll tell you as I'm starting to blend. Um, they did this thing now, lifetime members, we have to weigh in once a month now. So if we don't weigh in once a month, they're canceling our membership. So I had to upgrade my membership and we weigh in once a month. So I gained five pounds after I lost weight over Easter and going away with the girls, gained five pounds, whatever. You know what happens. I don't care. I wasn't going to get all upset about it. 
And now because I'm weighing in once a month, I'm not going to weigh myself until that month. So you only have to listen to me talk about it once a month. So if you are, you know, struggling or trying to lose weight or whatever, I feel you. So what we've done is Todd and I agreed. He's on board. He's like, yep, let's do it. We're not eating dinner at lunch and lunch at dinner. So I just had a sandwich. So I, oh, dosh gang, what do you call it? Dosh ga gamut. Dosh garnet? Yeah, dosh garnet. Whatever. I just, I just dipped my blue in the green. Oh, no. I know. It's your fault. Oh, no. It's your fault. Oh, you okay, I'm going to rub it off and dip it back in my blue. You know what's crazy? These two ink pads, this one always doesn't matter how much re-inker I put in it, it always feels dry to me. And this one, I only need a little bit of re-inker and the thing is so saturated, it's not even funny. So my mandala, I have a card I did already, okay? And I used one of the um, brush stroke backgrounds, but I wanted to play with this because I just feel with the image and what's happening in the image that this just kind of goes with it. So that's, yeah, you'll see. You'll see as it comes together. So this is like make a splash. So you can use it, you know, for any kind of splashy whatever. And the Wendy Vinci make art. Oh, I have to tell you guys something. These magnets. Oh, I have got you guys. I've got you guys. Stampin' Up! sells these for 12 bucks a pair plus shipping which if you only order those it's 9.95 shipping but i have found these and i just ordered 60 of them so i'm going to break them apart i'm going to sell them in twos for you guys on my new website oh i, I got you guys i'm so excited oh i'm so excited because i need more of these because these things you know they are super sticky so, or super sticky, super magnety. Just if you wear a pace, pacemaker, do not use these. Okay, and I'm gonna have to put a disclaimer on them on my website. If you have a pacemaker, do not, under any circumstances, use those. I think, I don't know how far I wanna go with my green, so let's pull this off a little and have a peek. Ooh, I think that's it. I think that's it right there. Cause I just want a little bit of something, something. ooh. I might have gone a little high, but that's okay. That's okay. I like it. Now let's go with a little bit more blue. Make it just a little darker in this area. These I link below. Everything you see me use is linked below. Or the very first link below is everything I use. And it takes you to my kit.co. So you can click that and go looking in all the categories, which eventually they will all just be on my website which is going to be so awesome and don't ever let them do that because they can break yeah, okay break. yes they can they'll break they can you're absolutely right dear don't all right that. now just a tip Ugh. these are very 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 magnety but just a quick tip for you guys which i did not link this but it's all right I take ba, 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 this guy, open it up, and I, I put a little alcohol marker on the little drops there, and then yellow on this one, so I know this is sunshine and this is wet, meaning, meaning I can take my cleaner and spray here, and then I can go like this, but I like to put a towel because my hand will get super wet if I don't. Just rub it around and then it's almost clean. Done. And dry it and I'm good to go. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Finished. All right. Now put this away. Okay. So what I've done. Oh, can you just behave down here doesn't want to sit are you related to Todd Shh. oh my gosh okay Shh. what is that all about all the noise you're making <laughs> I have a video I linked it below for you guys it's how to make these here shadow um, letters shadow words if you will and I like I said I linked the video for you guys but I've got the word me. Wait until you guys see what I'm putting on this card. 
it's too funny. So, um, I know how I'm going to do the giveaway. It just occurred to me. I know how I'm going to do it. Well, it didn't quite just occur. I, w I was going to change it, but I think this will be funnier. I think it'll be more fun and interactive. So, yeah. I, I, I'm going to do it the way we were going to do it. The way I told that thing I told you to write down. I was going to make you remember the name of that stencil. But I think I have a, a, a funner, funner, more interactive little way. So, I found that this Recollections, for those of you that don't have a Michaels near you, it's on Amazon. So, I was like, yay. I linked the Recollections now. And this stuff, I love cutting it on my Cricut because it's nice and thin. And it cuts beautifully. And it look at it even cuts a little teeny letters like that. Super small. Now, I did something because last week I made this card, if you remember. And this was silver, remember? And I said I wanted it to be black. So ugh, I was being lazy, but I'm so glad I was being lazy because I was going to just put the black over top of the silver like ever so perfectly. And when I put it down, it kind of slipped because the glue was, you know, slippery. And I was like, ooh, that's kind of a neat effect, right? So that was the silver foil. You can go back at that video video or link of the video, the video link below talks about all of that, okay? So I thought that was kind of cool. This is for my wino friend. Hello, wino. I haven't done the inside. But when I did that, I thought, hold on, because I had started out thinking I wanted a golf cart, okay? So wait till you see the little funny sentiment here it's hilarious but I thought uh I didn't really like the silhouette and then I tried coloring it gray I think that was this one no it was one of them anyway I was like eh, no I don't like it and then I pulled out this stuff and this is the sparkle iron on vinyl or iron on foil Cricut, okay, which I did link for you guys. And when you take click that link and it shoots you off to Amazon, take that name, copy it, and paste it into the address bar because there's other companies. I haven't tried them, but I mean, it's, it's you're only using it for this. You're not even using it for iron-on, right? And it's really inexpensive. So I may pick some up at some point. I just have a an entourage of it. I have so much of it. There's no need for me to buy it yet. But just type that into the address bar and I'll still get the affiliate credit. So you're still supporting me and you're saving money and getting an off brand because this here is, like I said, iron on. And I put it here and I was like, okay, all right. But when I was done the card, I thought, I think I want it black and you'll see why. So I put this guy a little offset. So there was a little bit of like that holographic, you know, still on here. So let me go to him. His ear. He's got, he's got, someone stabbed him through the head with oh. a, with a golf club. That's got to hurt. Well, I figured you would say something like that. So I, I got beat you to it. Cause you know, you're always coming up with funny little things, but. Better than peeing like an astronaut. I have that card actually. I, I took my, that Father's Day card home from dad's because he throws everything away right now and I brought it home so I could fix it so this here the little the little twine came off of his hand so this goes like that and this was actually the very first alcohol ink project I ever made I went to paper and ink with Cheryl Lee um, I was like, this was me. I was like, I'm never buying alcohol inks. That is, I'm not investing in that. That's way too expensive. I can do other things. I'm not even into that. We'll just go to a class. Shirley, you should have said no. Let's not go to the class because now I think I have 60% of all the colors, but that's okay. So that was my Father's Day card for dad. This one is not my Father's Day card for dad. <laughs> This one is for your sweetie, remember? So, oh, look at this. I didn't even put out a fresh sheet for all my my friends today. My gosh, slacker, what the hey? All right, so I'm just gonna lay this down. And you have a little wiggle room because it's Tombow. 
And speaking of Tombow, I'll tell you why I placed an order there. I have like all of this back here to do an unboxing, but they have these big, huge ones. And I'm going to tell you, oh my gosh, was I upset because I placed a whole order. And then on Tuesday this week or yesterday, everything was 40% off. I was like, of course it is. Of course it is when I ordered 12 of these. What did you buy? I bought glue. So there's that. Okay. Now what I'm going to do is this. For the giveaway, everybody pay attention. Refresh your screens, make sure you're not in top chat, make sure you're in live chat, make sure you're hearing me. I'm gonna go to live chat because I'm in top yeah, chat as I'm well. In top chat as well. Okay, go to live chat, we'll change that to that. live chat. There, that's oh. how it appears as people say it. Make sure you're watching the stream as it as it's live because you're gonna watch me put this sentiment together and the first person who can type in the chat, I'll oh, never exactly. Yes, I know, Cheryl Lee. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. We 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 didn't get any discount, but any we we didn't even get we didn't even get the ten percent for a new person because I forgot. <laughs> anyway, so Todd has it written down on his sheet, right? Don't say it out loud. I'm going to type it in the chat so I can win. <laughs> so you're going to watch the chat. The first person who can read out what it is that I'm spelling up here for the sentiment will win the new, not even released yet, mandalas and more stencil set, which is this one that I just showed you guys. Okay. Mandalas and more. You will win that. I will mail it to you. So I am going to start. I got to look at my thingy here. Oh, I got, look, I got men falling for me. Okay. So let me start getting these together. I think I'll do it like, I think I'll do it in a fun way. You know, like, oh, someone doesn't go that way. And I'm not going to rush. I'm going to put these, you know, I'm going to arrange them as I'm going because, um, yeah. So here we go. So the first person who can type out, it's kind of like playing Wheel of Fortune. We gotta have a game, right? So the first person who can type out what this sentiment is going to be, what these are going to say, wins that stamp set. Or that, excuse me, stamp set. You know what I mean. That, what is it called, honey? Help me out. What? Stencil set. A stencil set. Okay, this letter goes over here. No. Right about there. Oh, I spelled it wrong. You just hush, hush, hush. Okay, and then we'll do this one right about here. And this one. Now I want this one. Yeah, this one. Oh, what do you got on you? Goes over here. And I'll put this one here. And I'll put this one. <laughs> it's so funny this saying oh and you guys are gonna laugh like some of you are gonna be like oh, oh but you're hopefully you're laughing because you know if you don't get it before someone else gets it so this word is part of this <clears throat> Excuse me. That this word down here is part of it. Okay, so I want it. I want it all, including the word me. So the last word is me, and it's a it's a Father's Day card for your sweetie. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna put give him a hint. I'm gonna. No, it. you're not giving hint. any hints. No, do not give any hints I'll whatsoever. Give a hint. Not one hint. Watch the chat. Watch the chat. Oh, Watch. Leslie won it. See? Talk birdie to me. <laughs> Leslie got it. Well, Talk did, did birdie she? to me. Did she? Yeah. I don't know. She did. It says talk birdie to me. Oh, I spelled birdie wrong. Oh, whatever. It's the same thing. Birdie. You know what? It's like not everybody spells inky, I-N-K-I-E. I'll give it to her because she got it. So that's that's fair enough. So talk birdie to me. That is our little golf card. 
And Todd was like, was going to give you guys a hint, think golf. Um, of course you got to think golf. The guy, I gave you the guy. So I'm going to just kind of arrange these. And I want them to be a little bit wonky because it's a fun, humorous card. And here, and then here, whoopsie. And I didn't save my tittles because I'm gonna show you something else I'm gonna do. And it's so funny, my mom was here. Um, actually, she was cutting stencils for me. And I said, can you Google um, if tittle originated in Britain? And she's like, um, well, there is tittle in, in Britain, but it's, you gotta go potty. <laughs> You're gonna go tittle. That's what it is in Britain. I was like, okay, so that's not where the word tittle came from. I don't know where it came from. I was gonna like tell you guys, oh, it came from whatever. And um, I can't because, okay, let's take these off. We're gonna put these down first because you know what? It's gonna take the longest. It is a cute card, isn't it? I haven't seen you in a while, Miss Mama Loves to Craft. So I'm gonna grab it with my little wand and I didn't put any of my tools because they're all in the tools section. So if you click the very first link under supplies, it takes you to my kit. Supplies? Yeah, and all my tools are in the tools section. And when you scroll down, you gotta wait because there's a load more for more, um, more, uh, category boxes, if you will. So it's going to take me a minute, but that's okay because we have a half an hour. We have all this time together. So I want to hear what some people are doing for Mother's Day. Todd and I are taking our mothers on a um, train um, thing. Um, what's the name of the area? I have no idea. Okay, we're taking them to I have no idea area. And we're going a on a train. It's a brunch, Mother's Day brunch. But a bank robbery. But there's a there's a train robbery, not a bank robbery. We're not at a bank. We're on a train. But, but there's a bank on the train. No, there's a vault. Oh. Anyway, there's going to be a mock train robbery. So we're anyway. That's what we're doing for Mother's Day. So I'd like to hear. Oh, and then Todd's going to take me for sushi. He just doesn't know it yet. Actually, I told you yesterday you were going to take me for sushi. No, right? I'm going for Thai. So, um, well, there'll be no talking birdie if you don't take me for sushi. <laughs> oh no, that stinks that you have COVID. Yesterday, I COVID. have to tell you, I didn't do a dang thing yesterday. I was not feeling good. I had to have a nap and my mom was like, I hope you don't have COVID. I'm like, I hope not too. She's like, well, it's too late if you do because I'm around everybody. So thankfully it wasn't. I was just really under the weather. I didn't sleep well and hey, 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 you gotta go over here please before you touch the paper. Thank you. All right. With these, Elizabeth, if you have trouble getting the glue out, make sure you get all the glue off of here and just put a pin in it. You don't wanna leave these out and open for a long time. You wanna keep this little thing put over top of it. So just put a pin down in it like one of these, Just you know, da -da 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 -da, and you'll be fine. Mine rarely clogs, but if I leave it open for quite a bit of time, it definitely will clog. So be careful of that, okay? So this is like performing, you know, a game operation. That's what this is like. Because these letters are little, but that recollections paper <clears throat> cuts it out so simply. And I'm gonna let you guys in on a secret, okay? Come back to this video on the weekend, I shouldn't even tell you this, I could get in huge trouble, probably. I don't know, maybe I can't, I'm not even sure, but Cricut is having a sale this weekend. Shh. You didn't hear it here. <clears throat> They're having a sale. And I'm gonna highly recommend for all of my, all my inky friends that are on a tight budget, you know, um, get the air. <clears throat> I have the air over there and I'm not parting with it because there's nothing wrong with it. And when I'm doing like a big job and I need to cut multiples all at the same time, back when I was cutting my stencils on my Cricut, you can use that. There's nothing wrong with the Cricut Air and it's a great machine and it's inexpensive. So definitely have a peek at that. I just got a note. Would you guys like to see what my note is? He took it away. Can I have my note? Oh, <clears throat> it's the best writing ever. <laughs> Hi, Simon. 
I have to tell you guys something Simon said to me. Simon said, Simon said, Simon said, be nice. Happy wife, happy life. That's what Simon said. So I was chatting with Simon on Instagram um, yesterday and I was talking about my address because I don't know. Shh, don't tell anybody. It's a secret, but he might, he may or may not be sending me some things. So I made a comment about my road. I live on Silverado Skies Drive. And I said to him, be sure the parcel says drive. Don't shorten it to DR because oftentimes the people that deliver the mail don't read. I know a shocker, right? They don't read. And then they deliver my parcel to Silverado Skies Cress, C-R-E-S for Crescent instead of DR for drive, or I get their mail, like they order from the Gap a lot, and my UPS guy delivers it here. So, but normally I can catch it because um, I answer the door. But anyway, he goes, Simon goes, oh, Silverado Skies. That's a really nice name for a blue. And it's like, yep, we get the first ink. <laughs> I love it. I expect to see Silverado Skies like yep 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 that is an awesome that that kid is always thinking his mind is always going I love it I love it it's a beautiful name it's an awesome name now I can't use it but I don't ever plan on you know launching ink so there's that yeah the note say hi to Simon you could honey you yes. could say hi to Simon because like you could be friends I'm not like, allowed to talk <laughs> okay you know i asked for like a husband beater can you get me like you know something to like smack myself because sometimes I, there are days where after the stream i'm like honey you need to talk to me more you don't say much and he's like well i, w I was talking i'm like no he goes well i was talking to them well i was well that's the most important thing right so if you don't have this fine tip glue bottle yet, then you are definitely not a self-respecting inky friend. And it is in the tools section of my kit.co. And there are multiples of them. And trust me, you will use multiples because they've got um, some of them, especially like your gold, because you're always adding gold to everything. So that's like, I have a lot of my um, Jacquard alcohol inks because they are so concentrated that you can mix them in these bottles and uh, I watched a video and she said to mix them 50 50 I'm gonna say to mix them two parts alcohol ink one part alcohol because I kind of feel like I washed mine out a bit doing that which I wasn't overly pleased with I'm just trying to decide which way I want this one to go because they're not quite turning out the way that card did but that's perfectly fine so we're almost there we're almost there but this one I'm going to show you the um, first one I did because I told you guys that I did it on the uh, brush stroke brush stroke stencils so I have pulled the page you guys will notice if you're on my website you can't see the stencils but I got a web designer redesigning my whole website I'm so excited oh my gosh I cannot wait it's supposed to be launched by Wednesday that's the deadline so we shall see so if they can get it together and launch for Wednesday I may launch on Thursday the new the new stencils and the nice thing about having my own website like cart system and everything and thank you Wendy for doing a test order for me she wanted um, some stencils so I asked her if she would kindly order through there and she did but having a website I can start to do little discounts and things I'm like yay I can run disc I can run sales I can run discount codes I can like I'm like yeah so besties will get a discount code definitely so if you are not a bestie and you've been thinking about becoming a bestie now might be the time besties will get a discount code they always get a discount code when I launch something so here we go I put two little dots there because these we all know what these are these are those things here like they put on your nails and actually I just got some really cool ones I'm going to show you guys at some point but oh I don't want silver see I got silver on the mind here I bought these at the Dollarama 
10 years ago, I bought, I don't know, six or 10 packets. I bought so many of them. They don't have them anymore, thank God. And that's the thing about the dollar store. When you see something, you better get it now because it probably won't be available later. Can you color with circle, well, where did I see this? Uh oh, circle point pens without the machine? Can what? I have no idea. Can you color, color with Cricut with... point oh, Cricut. pens? Oh, oh, of course you can. Of course. Absolutely, if you have Cricut markers and you don't have a Cricut, and I'll tell you, just a quick tip, Cricut's got this sneaky little thing, okay? And unless you use Cricut fonts for writing, it will not fill in. But these big letters, just write them and it does the outline and then color them in. Color them in with your Cricut markers, color them in with other markers, doesn't matter, you know, you do you, but yeah. M Mosley, isn't that it? I don't know. Are we going to Mosley? I'm not sure. I might vlog it. I might vlog it. We'll see. So now we're going to do this and then I'm going to do something else to this. <gasps> oh, 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 I forgot. I forgot. I always forget. It's your fault. You distract me with your silliness. Simon's fault. He came in here and all I'm thinking about now is blue ink pads. It's always the guy's fault. I forgot to splatter. Champagne mist. <sighs> Champagne mist splatter. The recipe for this is in my sprays and splatters video. Just go to my channel and when you're on my channel type in new sprays and splatters actually you could just go to youtube and type in new sprays and splatters recipes bam youtube's got my back it'll show up it will show up now i'm gonna have to be very careful here so let's grab oh here he is here's the one i was going to show you guys i tried <laughs> his legs are kind of curly i tried to color him gray but he didn't really turn out but i'm thinking if i lay him here, let's cut his legs off. There we go. If I lay him over top of my talk birdie to me, then I won't get a little black. Oh, he won't lay flat, though. Lay Are flat. Are on sale yet? Shh. Shh. No? This weekend. This weekend. Shh. Should I tell anybody? Shh. Yeah, show that comment, too. Show. Here, I'll show it. Show Karen's comment. There we go. There, ah, ah. there we go. Show it. Okay, this isn't working because they're not curling, or they're curling on me, so I'll have to use something else. Here, let's use this little piece of paper. So I got this and that. I know you guys can't see. Sorry, 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 sorry. Here, let me move it. I can't see what you see. Here we go. Okay, there we go. I just have to cover that. Sorry, I was doing that off screen. I apologize. I'm trying to, like, not get my black letters too, you know, splattered up. <gasps> what happened? What? Well, Pammy said, ouch. Oh, that's because men are being blamed for everything. Oh, well, that's just a given. Come on. Oh, I forgot to tell you that. It's always your fault. That Lana's looking again at the crickets. Oh, well, you tell Chris she better use my link. And Mother's Day. Why don't you tell him to buy her one for Mother's Day? Oh, that's a good idea. That's a great idea. Mother's Day gift. There you go. You can get her her Cricut Maker. She wants, like, the whole shebang, though. She wants, like, the whole kit and caboodle with all the things. Of course she does. She just wants the bang and not the shh. No, she wants the shh and the bang. Okay, so I'm going to use this because I am so tired of all my things falling everywhere. Oh yeah, look at this. I bring this out to keep everything organized and then I can't find it. So this little side went to the market. This little side um, was left over because I cut it, you know what I mean? So I'm just gonna cut these off of here in the sizes I need, just with my fingers. No, you know, special tools except the Cricut tool because I use this for everything. If you took this away from me, this, I, I, honest to God, I have like these in my travel bag too. I could not live without that. And those little dollar store ones are just fine. The ones I got at Dollarama, I took it on the weekend, my girls weekend away when I made all the Christmas cards. Oh, tomorrow night, channel members, channel members, tomorrow night is the 
Friday free for all where I do whatever the free for all I want. And it's supposed to be two hours and it always ends up being way more like our bestie thing. How, how long were we on our bestie thing? Um, you know, for at the end of the month, all the besties get the real time stamp and chat. We started at six. I think I finally shut it down at 11. <laughs> I mean, a lot of people went to bed before us. So you do not want to miss tomorrow night. I'm going to finish off my Halloween cards and then do something fun. And I always show you guys all my little things and I tell you all my secrets. So you definitely want to be a channel member by tomorrow. And that is for all channel members, by the way. All channel members get to come to the free for all. This one I cut super skinny so I could get it in here. Oh, let's go. Let's go. There we go. And if you peel the backing off, you can bend them a little easier too, right? So let's pull this guy off here and we'll put you... Let's separate this. What let's go right down night? the middle. Six o'clock. Same time as it was tonight. Except it's a... <clears throat> excuse me. It's a, it's a private video for channel members. So when you become a member of my channel, a new thing appears and it's called memberships. And you'll see all the little things like you can go to my home, you can go to my videos, you can click all those things like uploads, whatever. There'll be a new one, community, there'll be a new one. It says memberships. And down there is where you see all the links. Now, if you're a member at the beginning of the month, when I mail out or I create those videos for everybody, you get an email. So all you got to do is look on the membership or if you want the email, you can always go to my website and join as an inky bestie and I will send you an email. But if you want to come tomorrow night, you better send me that email before lunch <laughs> because people join at like 555 and then they get mad at me because I didn't give them the link. They had to watch the replay. Well, at 555. I'm getting ready for the video. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Don't yell at me. I'll cry. All right. So here we go. So that wasn't too bad. It only took me about 37 minutes to do that part. But now, hun, hun. Yes, dear. Open the second drawer down there, please. Oh, never mind. I got some over here. I need a piece of paper, a certain piece of paper. This color right here. Hold on. One second by five and three eighths. Another thing that I like is I actually showed everybody, um, and you know me, I don't, I don't like throw products under the bus, but I'm going to say something here. Nope, that's the right one. Hold on. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey. Calm down. I got to show you guys something. I need uh, you to give me a piece of paper because I got the wrong one. Piece of paper? Yeah. Kind of paper. Well, yes. suck your thing in. Hold whoa, on. Whoa, whoa. Hold on, hold on, hold whoa, on. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Not this one. No. Where did it go? I threw it out. You need the, my recollections here. It's it all gone. It's here. Okay. In, in, in. Okay. All right. I got to show you guys something. I showed all my besties this. Okay. See the difference here between these two cardstocks? Okay. And all the ink I have on my fingers. You see how black this one is? So black. I love it. It's so black. This is the Recollections. This is the Stampin' Up. Recollections. 65 pounds. Very inexpensive. But I'm going to use it for my um, backgrounds because, or my, these things. What do you call these? My mats, thank you. Because why do I need 80 pound cardstock behind 80 pound cardstock that's going on 120 pound cardstock or 110 pound, whatever the heck it is? Why do I need that? I don't. So I love this Recollections. I, honest to God, I would have never bought Recollections if it hadn't have been that I needed some cheap black paper for something else. And then I got on this bandwagon. I was buying it, the golds and the bra bra bronzes and stuff for other things. But I'm telling you, I'm loving it. And if you got a Michaels near you, don't click my link and buy it on Amazon. Wait. Wait for the buy one, get one half off or buy two, get one free or use your 30% off coupon. I'm like, you know, I always appreciate it when you guys use my links, but please don't do that and 
you know, if, if you can go in store and get your discount and save money because then, then you can be putting your pennies on other things, right? So that black is amazing. So I will no longer be buying Stampin' Up! Black. And if there's a company out there watching this that has very, very dark black 80 pound cardstock, send me a message on Instagram. I would love to see it. Hundo percent because I need an 80 pound black. But I need another little piece here for his little puck. puck. What what do you call the end of the 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 oh the wood, right? Is it called a wood? No. The end of the 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 golf well, club. Isn't it called a wood? No, it's not made of wood anymore. It's called oh darn, I forgot one thing. Okay, so the other thing I have to do is ba ba ba, ba these are linked for you guys. Number 10, secure gel. I'm just gonna squiggle on my Simon Says Stamp little black spot there so I can get it going. And you know, I've showed you guys this before. Actually, this was in the um, last month's Master Pro Tips for Card Finishing Things. Things I do to just, you know, make your cards pop a little bit more this was the one of them head. but you get them all in the yeah. same class and when the website launches one of the goals i have is to list all my classes on there now you won't have a problem drawing your lines if you do this before you put on all your dimensionals but again i didn't think of it so i have to do it with my dimensionals on here so it's just a line, okay, and three little dots, and then a line. I think I'll do this line on the outside, and three little dots, and a line, and three little dots, and a line with three little dots. And I'm going to do it to him because, you know what, look, I'll show you. There's him now next to this thing, okay, so there he is, right? Then I'm going to do this and you let me know what you think because I'm going to make this just a little bit more visually interesting with a few of these just here and there. doesn't have to be perfect. Just a little bit. A few lines. Oh, what? I'm going to turn them upside down and make it easier for me here. And there's no reason you can't do this, like go around a corner, you know what I mean? Or like here, I'll go around his elbow. We'll go this way. And I like to keep all my dots the same. I like to keep them all you down. Have a smiley face. Instead of um <laughs> Oh honey. Honey, honey, honey. A smiling face. I got something on my finger here. There it goes. A smiling face. He says, Are you in? You're in. Okay. Here we go. And we're gonna go one, two, three, and a little line there. And did I do any on his head? I didn't. Okay, so there. That's all I'm gonna do. And then I shall zoom out a foot of you guys. There we go. Now, just that little bit, just kind of, you know, we're not finished yet though. Oh, I might go over. Maybe not. Maybe not. Maybe not. We're not finished yet though. Let me bring my little bowl. I went to HomeSense and I got this pretty little bowl in the dishes section. This marker was broke. My cap got cracked and I taped it, but my marker keeps drying out, so I'm not really feeling it anymore. I'm getting another one. But I just put some little things the on the bottom so I don't push it off my workstation and smash it. But it's my it's my GB. Oh, Kathy Richards and Inky Bestie. Yay! Welcome, Kathy. Oh, Kathy, Kathy. Kathy, Kathy, Kathy. I think you have a form to fill out somewhere. You better get on that, Missy. Oopsie. Oopsie, oopsie. Or maybe you already did. I just know. I know names. Well, that's not necessarily true. I don't always know names, but sometimes I know names. And I think I need some on his feet. I forgot his feet. But I have one other little thing to add to this card that'll just kind of bring it all together. Come on, get off there. I do I do like this stuff, but it's doesn't it's not quite as easy to peel the little things off when you have fake nails. 
thought I told you to mute. I need that husband it's the beater. Alarm. If you guys saw, if you didn't see in the beginning not my coming. happy meal that I got sent, I need a husband beater. You know those foam things that you go to the like football games and they have like a hand and like you can be like, eh. well, I need like a long one, like a long one. I can just, 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 just you know. This is a family channel. There's no abuse here. I'm just kidding. Oh, oh where'd the other piece go? Oh, there it is. I need them on his feet. Just, just on his feet. Ah. Okay, just right here. Just a little bit. Just one there. There we go. And just one over here. There we go. So, I know that there's no stamps, but I wanted to point out that if you're struggling for masculine stuff, maybe don't go shopping for stamps. Because you know what happens? You buy those stamps that you need for that masculine card, and then you're not inspired to make masculine cards. So think outside of the box, and then use your supplies that you have, or, you know, put that, put those pennies towards things that you are going to use, right? Like paper, or ink, or dies a machine I mean how long do you think for those of you that don't have a cricket how long do you think it would take you if you didn't buy your dies to get a cricket like and I, I'm not talking about dies for your stamps I'm talking about dies that make words like these okay if you restrained yourself and said I'm not buying any more dies that are words or dies that make boxes or dies that you know remember when I told you guys I'm not buying dies that that make things anymore because I have a machine to do that I'm just being lazy and I know that I know a lot of my Yankee friends are lazy too but if you're really wanting a machine how many pennies could you put away seven if you put away $25 for four months, you could almost get your, your Cricut Air. I don't know in four months if they're going to have any left, though, because they have, you know, all the newer machines now. But that does not mean that the Cricut Air, there's anything wrong with it, right? So, nevertheless, too stinking cute, right? Look at this one. Oh, wait, wait. I got one more thing. Hold on. This little guy. This little guy. Now, my 15 is dry. So, these are, that's for his beak, that's for his beak. So, I wasn't really happy about this at all, but here, I'll zoom in so you can watch me color. This isn't any fanciness here going on because this one is just a bird. He's just tiny. Now, this one came out of the Simon Says Stamp Spring Nomi set, and I got to tell you, look at the color of him. He's used this one and this one. I use him a lot. I haven't used some of oh, the butterflies too, but I use him a lot. I love this little bird. He's so cute. And I was going to do him blue, but I already have blue in the card. So I thought, eh, maybe I'll do him yellow. And I know it's kind of more, it's springy, right? But you know what? It's your card. You do you. And you put whatever color you like, whatever color your little heart desires. Oops, wrong way. This way. And what's that? I'm all sniffly again. <laughs> Maybe I'm allergic to you. Could be. Might be that. Could be allergic to you, honey. Maybe it... No, I'm good. I always get congested. <coughs> <coughs> Dusty. In the Kleenex? Maybe. Oh. <coughs> My throat is very dry. Okay. Excuse me, sorry. Maybe. All of a sudden, my throat got really dry and I got sniffly. Could be hay fever. <coughs> I hope not. Ugh. Now I feel like I'm going to sneeze. <laughs> Good grief. And actually, I didn't think this one was light enough, so I'm going to use the 17 here. Just a little bit on the end of his nose. And then this little darker orange just to kind of differentiate. <coughs> Good grief. Okay, now let me cut this out, fussy cut, because apparently people are like, we can't hear you when you go to your cricket. So, you know, this is what we used to do in the day. And I did a thing with. with um, scissors? Yeah, I did a video. Mm. 
with uh, Antonio Makes way back when on my Facebook group and he had me make a card but the entire card even the card <coughs> I had to cut out with scissors I was not allowed to use a trimmer or anything I was only allowed to use scissors so that was interesting now him I'm trying to cut him closer than the traditional you know space that the dies would leave and I don't have the dies to go with this one because you guys know I don't buy dies unless they're ten dollars for the set at Pink and Main I mean the stamp sets worth more than ten dollars so when she has a bundle Miss Michelle over there with her little you know ten dollar bundles um, yeah I'm gonna buy that and you can always go to um, my kit.co and I have my favorite shops right at the very top you can always click on that and go and visit any of my favorite shops like my favorite things or if you're like what store was she talking about <coughs> excuse me you can probably go there and oh my eyes are watering uh, so I'm so sorry good thing you're more than six feet away right because you never know now they're saying that um, there's uh, there's evidence now of people that had COVID. There's evidence that it's affecting their um, neurological, uh, neurologically, like you can, it's aging you like 20 years in your mind, your brain function. Well, that's good for some of us. Uh, You're uh, having your brain function be aged 20 years? Yeah. How's that good, honey? Not so much like a kid. Oh, <laughs> I'm always telling Todd. He's, I always tell Todd it's like living with a teenager. <laughs> uh, so now you'll be in university. Well, no, 20 years. Well, I guess you'd be in your 30s. That'd be nice, hey, honey? That would be. I wonder if people would call me, what would they call me? Like a cradle robber person. Call you an old Bubba. An old Bubba? Why? Are you calling me fat? No, Bubba's grandma. Okay. <laughs> Bubba's grandma? Yeah. Did you call your grandma Bubba? One of them. Bubba is like a bottle. I would have thought of a bottle. My grandma's Nana, and she turns 90 on the 15th. 90. 90 years old. Okay, so here we go with this guy. And I'm going to put one little piece on the back of him. We'll go right about like this, and I'll leave a little square there. Perfect. Is this too big? Are you too big? Maybe not. Maybe not. There we go. Perfect. Talk birdie to me. Karen, Karen says cougar. <laughs> uh, yeah, I've heard. Hey, I'm a puma, honey. I'm a puma. Pumas are fast and sleek. I'm a puma. All right. So I figured the little birdie right here on the letters because it just kind of seemed suiting to talk birdie to me. So I shall put this on my, oh, wait, I, I'm like, did I do my giveaway? I did. Did I? I don't know. Oh yeah, I did my giveaway. Which one? I did. What was what? her name? I don't know. What was her name? I didn't write it down. Oh, it was, you gotta scroll back. Oh, you gotta go find it. I don't know where that is. You gotta find it. Can somebody tell me her name? Too far back. You have to fill out a winner's form down below. Then I'll know her name. Oh. There you go. I'm so bad with names. When I graduated nursing school, I would grab the chart and you know, you've got your hovering people, you know, making sure you do everything right. Actually, not even when I graduated, I'm sorry, I lied. I was still, I was still um, in practicum. And I would read the chart and go into the room. And then I was like, excuse me, I would have to go back out and read the chart. That's how bad it was. That's how bad, I'm terrible, terrible, terrible with names. Leslie Olson one. Yes, Leslie one. Olson, that's it. I wrote that one down. That's it. The other two are way up here and I don't know where they are. Wait, no. Yeah. Leslie Olson one she she, she did, did the, the talk birdie. birdie to me. Yes. Yeah, that's what I, I need. need. Leslie O. Leslie O. I can't write in white. I can't I guess I have to write in this. Dang. Leslie. Oh, okay. So the other one I did. If you have the brush stroke stencils and I just I wanted to do this one here because it was a little bit different of a background and it just kind of like the way the splash works you don't have to use it as a splash so I just wanted you to see that you don't have to think water because you've got it's called 
make a splash, right? So I don't know, which one do you guys like better? A or B? If you watched the beginning of the video, there is a giveaway for a, I was gonna, call, I was gonna say what it is. <laughs> And you needed to watch the video to know what it is but there is a giveaway for a stamp and die set this is from the stamps of life they gave it to me with the kit last month that i opened for you guys i have so many stamps and dies i chose to give this one away to you guys i want to you to watch the video in the beginning and i tell you what i need to know for you to be eligible to win that and i will draw that next thursday so B, 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 Mandy likes B. And there's like everybody's A and B, A and B. It's both, you know, it is what it is. A They're B, both oh. cute, so talk birdie to me. Someone said C. <laughs> Those will probably end up on my Etsy or my actual website. Go figure, I might actually put my cards on there. So thank you for joining us tonight. I see it's 7.01, we're right on time. Is there anything written down on your sheets? Any questions that I yes, didn't cover? Yes, Leslie Olson won. Okay, oh, Leslie Olson won. Uh, Kathy Lamb, are you doing an SU catalog review? I am not. I'm no longer a demonstrator, and um, I'm probably not. I, I have one. I, are we allowed to show it yet? Where's that catalog I got? No, you're not allowed to show it. Uh, well, I'm allowed to do this. I did get one, and there are some things I like. Maybe I should do one. I don't know. What do you guys think? There's some things that there's some things that I like in here. I think that there's um, some some things that they're doing to kind of step up a little bit. Um, there's some things I like. There's some neat ideas. But yes, I I have friends in high places who know exactly who they are. But I did get my inky little fingers on this catalog. I've got to take it over and get it spiral bound. But um, leave me a comment down yes, below. Yes, you can show it now. If you, uh, oh yeah, May, oh it did launch, it's that's right. Now. It is live, May 3rd. That's May 3rd. That's right. That's so, leave me, so I'm not a demo anymore, I don't even, I don't even think about these things, but leave me a comment down below, and if enough people say they want to, actually let's do it by likes. Leave me a comment and like the video. If this video gets 500 likes, I'll do a Stampin' Up! catalog review. How about that? Okay? Okay. 500 likes. Leave me comments it's down 500? below. 500 is a lot. 500 is a lot when you get, like, you know, between four and 6,000 views on a video. So I, I know the numbers. I know, I know. But thank you for joining us tonight. Um, I wish they would too, Julie. I wish Stampin' Up! would collaborate with all the Simon Says Stamp, Gina K's, all of those everybody's of the world. It would all be, it we would all be playing in the same sandbox. It would be lovely, but they choose not to. And that's, yeah. that's, that's their right, right? So do you want to say goodnight, honey? Good night, honey. Good night. See, happy wife, happy life. Yeah. Good night, everybody. I will see all of my channel members tomorrow night for the free for all, wherever I, where I do whatever the free for all I want. And until then, take care and happy stamping.